This is the solution to written homework 17. Okay, so this is uh, a cancellation circus. So the two of the four quadratics can be factored quite easily. So the ones that are not monic, I'll save those for next step. So I'll leave the numerators because they're not monic. But the denominator of the left uh, part of the division, two numbers whose product is negative 36 and whose sum is positive 5. How about positive 9 and negative 4? I'll leave this numerator to x squared minus x minus 15, and then two numbers whose product is positive 36, and whose sum is positive 13. How about positive 9 and positive 4? <coughs> okay, and now we want to factor these two numerators. Okay, so for 8x, we want two numbers whose product for the one that starts with 8, we want two numbers whose product is, um, so that would be 80 <coughs> plus 40 is 120, whose sum is 26. Ah, but that's easy, right? We could do uh, 6 and 20. sum is 26. So that tells us how to split that middle coefficient. So we'll say that 8x squared plus uh, 6x plus 20x plus 15. So we split 26 into 6 plus 20. In the first pair, we'll factor out 2x. So 2x multiplied by 4x plus 3, and then plus, we can factor out 5. So 5 multiplied by 4x plus 3, those are the same. So 2x plus 3 multiply, oh no, 2x plus 5 multiplied by 4x plus 3. So we factored that one. <coughs> now to factor the one in the top right, we want two numbers whose product is uh, 2 times negative 15. So that would be negative 30, and whose sum is negative 1. Mm, how about negative 6 and positive 5? Okay, good. So that tells us how to split that negative 1x. So we'll say that, that it splits as 2x squared minus 6x plus 5x minus 15. <clears throat> and then factor out the greatest common factor, which is 2x. So 2x, and then multiplied by x, minus 3. And then plus, the greatest common factor here is 5 times x minus 3. And again, we observe that these are the same. so happy about that. <clears throat> so that factors as 2x plus 5 times x minus 3. So now we factored all 
four quadratics. So with that intermediate work complete, we're looking at 2x plus 5 times 4x plus 3 over x plus 9 times x minus 4, and then divide 2x plus 5 times x minus 3 over x plus 9 times x minus 4. Okay, so now everything's completely factored. Now, division by a fraction is the same as multiplication by a reciprocal, so 2x plus 5 times 4x plus 3 over x plus 9 times x minus 4. And now we'll multiply by the reciprocal of this. So that would be x plus 9 multiplied by x minus 4 over 2x plus 5 times x minus 3. And now we want to cancel and ignore domain issues. So let's start pairing things off. So this 2x plus 5 will pair off with this one. So they will cancel and be absent from the result. <laughs> Nothing will cancel with the 4x plus 3. This x plus 9 can pair off with this one and they will cancel. And then this x minus 4 can pair off with this x minus 4. And now only the things that didn't pair off remain. So the result is 4x plus 3 divided by uh, x minus 3. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> no. So looking at the top here, that's x plus 4. So this is x plus 4. Somehow when I copied it down here, I almost overlooked that. So x plus 4, x plus 4. <clears throat> So let's change that to say that these look similar, x minus 4 and x plus 4. But they're not the same, so they do not cancel away. <clears throat> so then, so, but these are not the same. So the result is. four x plus three times x plus four divide by x minus four times x minus three. <laughs>